Hey, what's going on guys? I wanted to create this um, short video right here because um, I wanna show you how you can create oval shapes in Canva. Now that may sound a little bit strange, but I'm working on some graphic designs for my blog and I needed to have some oval shapes. And so I went in here to Canva to try to look for some and was having a little difficult time trying to find some that worked for me. Now I did come across some oval shapes and I'm gonna show you exactly what I came across. After looking through here thoroughly, I started searching through each one of these right here. And as you scroll over and you keep going over and over and over and you keep looking, I came across this right here, this tab that says oval. So I clicked on it and I'm like, okay, I think I'm close to what I'm looking for. And so I'm looking for something that's solid. So I want something that's filled in because I need text to go in it. And so I started clicking on these to see what I can find. Now, Canva does have some of these graphics that are oval shape, but you're kind of stuck with the, the size that they allow for you to have. So you can't really manipulate this shape very much. I mean, um, it is a bit oval, but it's not exactly what I'm looking for because I can only grab in the corners to enlarge it and make it smaller, but I can't, you know, change the oval shape and make it as oval as I want, I guess, if that's what you want to, that's the best way that I can explain it. So I started looking at down here and scrolling down and I, I kept thinking that, okay, I'll find another one. And I came across this one right here, but I noticed that all of these shapes, guys, you can't really do much with them. You can't change them other than making them bigger and smaller. So what I was looking for was something that I could either make it taller or, or shorter where I can, you know, change the size through here and I can't do that. So what ended up happening was I, I clicked on some of these that were not solid. And I realized that hmm, this one actually had an extra tab here that will allow me to make this shorter or longer, but look what it did to the, to the image. I mean, it's totally not what I wanted. And so I found this to be the case with all of them. So what I did was I started playing around with um, some other images that were on here and I decided to go look at some of the circle images. So I said, okay, let me try some circle images. Maybe I will find exactly what I'm looking for. So I clicked on a circle image and bam, there it is. And so I said, okay, this is perfect now because I can actually change this however I want. So I don't wanna just create some extremely large oval shape that you know doesn't allow for me to manipulate the shape. I want where I can actually change the size of this oval shape to as narrow as I want it to be. So if I want to create an oval shape that's extremely narrow, all I have to do is pull the tabs inside right here in the middle, these tabs right here that are inside. I can just change these and it won't cut into the actual shape like it did for the oval ones that, that were not filled in in the inside, it didn't change, you know, anything like that. I wanted to be able to just change the actual shape. And that's what the circles allowed me to do. And so just playing around here on Canva, just using some different designs for my graphics. And I realized that the oval shapes that I was looking for really didn't cut it for me. And so I actually had to go and find a circle design in order to be able to get what I want. So just a quick thought, you know, I wanted to share this with you guys that these um, designs that they have in Canva, I mean, you can really, when I say manipulate them, I mean, you can just change them into whatever it is that you want. So if there's something that you're not finding, like they have arrows and gradients and all kind of different stuff here, you can just change things around and almost create what Canva may not have. You know, if you play around with Canva enough, you will find that there's some things that you're able to create in here and make it your own. So I just wanted to share that with you guys that um, I was looking for something that will allow me to create an oval shaped design without actually taking away from the shape. Kind of like how this one is doing, that's not what I wanted. So I ended up finding this one right here that had additional tabs on each side that would allow me to make that oval shape as narrow as I want or as wide as I want. 
So, all right, guys. Well, that's just a thought. I just wanted to uh, share that with you. So just let me know down in the comment section below if this was helpful for you. And uh, I'm going to try and put out some more interesting Canva tutorials. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next video.